Now we have the most diminutive and saddest tree I think I've ever. This is probably this isn't even a tree. It looks like a feather duster. This it's looks, about two feet tall. It's all about the subtlety. Uh, but we'll get to let's get to the festive part, the more fun part. This is the one of the most fun contests I think we've ever had. Yes, I'm super excited about it. We love uh, our content. Uh, we love our listeners. Would. Jeff out there, he's sharing a, a drink recipe for us. Monster energy drink plus Jaeger, Monster Meister equals a happy, happy time. That sounds like... And domestic abuse, most likely. Probably. Yeah. Uh, looks like uh, we also got uh, Ron out there has some bud. So, Not share God. the bud. <laughs> bud, is, bud is good for festive... You, you for, got, but did you get it from underage children behind a parking lot, Ron? Do you have something to tell us? Are you on a watch list? No, I don't. No, he probably got it from a professional. Oh it's probably God. legal there because we're. It's not legal. Is it legal here? Sort of. It's yeah. I think you can be like <laughs> semi autistic and get it or something. Ron likes my uh, Spider Cash Man song. I it didn't even listen song. to it. No, I know. That's yeah. why we have less views because you didn't even bother. Nope. Didn't even share it. I didn't bought it. No. So. Okay. So we're going to get to the trees. Let's, we are. Let's get some trees going. So the, the, well, this is for a giveaway for James Bond. So the gift really, like, not the gift super was great. Us, though. <laughs> the, I mean, the, gift. <laughs> the gift itself, not super great. The gift but, was, was giving and sharing these trees. Like, I, I think this is... Now, okay, we'll make a little bit of a joke about it. And, um, don't take any offense if we make fun of your trees, because we'll show you... Make fun of your wood. Yeah, we're going to... Or lack thereof. <laughs> But it was really hard because everybody's picture sizes were the wrong size and wrong format. So I had to like scramble to get these out here. Yep. Oh man, Bud will get you arrested in Oklahoma. Oh my God. Mm. Who lives in Oklahoma? There's tornadoes there. All right. So you have the list of these trees, right? I think so. All right. So we're going to go through everybody's Christmas trees. We'll do a little bit of a Do we do critique. the reveal at the end or are we doing the reveal like mid tree? What? We're going to describe we'll the tree. We'll describe it first and then, then we'll reveal who it is. It is. Okay. Yes. Okay, so our first tree here, there's some things I really like about this tree. And one of them is the fact that there's pupper. I do it. like a mildly obese corgi. This is like, a, it's, 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 it's not a big tree, but it's very festive. There's some nice red balls on it. I see a reindeer hiding in it. It's got like a little, a nice little bow tree topper. But it's got a slightly obese corgi. It definitely is that corgi being abused because it's it slightly de- obese. No, I mean I tried to sexually abuse no, him but it last I saw. That. But uh, no, it's definitely. I can guess this tree belongs to a white man because it's tall and thin. So they are not packing that thick wood. Oh my gosh, this is not thick wood. This yeah. is this is a little bit on the thin. It's a thin boy. It is unlike so, their residents. On a scale of one to ten. I'm should we th- rate these trees? We is should. that fair? I don't know. Oh. Guys, out is that not nice? I mean, I, we can. Oh, whatever. We're if we can rate women. People call us rate. bigots all the time yeah. anyway. So let's rate your trees. On a scale of one to racist. No, how about just one to ten? Okay. I give it a solid, I think that's a, a seven. Maybe a seven and a half. Because Murphy Do we write these down? Uh, Are you giving away we'll who they remember are? it, maybe. Okay. Because this man lets me play and fondle him whenever I see him, I'm going to give him a solid eight. Oh, my God, I fondled him. <laughs> the tree has anorexia. Yeah. <laughs> it's a little on the thin side. That's all I'm saying. Okay, let's go to a seven. I'll give him a Anorexia. 7.5. Mark D drops an anorexia, anorexia joke, and it drops to a seven. 7.5. 7.5? Oh. It's got a corgi. It's, it, oh, the corgi gives it right back up 7. to a 7.5. 5. Let's, uh... <laughs> All right, we go to the next tree. Yeah. All right, are you writing these down? Nope. How are we gonna pick a winner? We're gonna figure it out. Oh, later. we'll just make it up. Yeah. Okay. Uh, who's gonna remember the scores? I no. will hope so. Ron. Oh, Ron gives it notes. a six. Oh, Ron's- Ron, you want to take? Why doesn't? We'll, maybe we'll go off a of Ron score. At yeah, the end. We'll, we'll let Ron notate some stuff. All right, here we go. Now I'm this gonna one, try to blow this one up a little bit here. This one I'm a fan of. This one is pretty. This one is pretty gorgeous. Like, and I could tell this comes from rich people. I was gonna say, if this isn't a rich white elitist, I don't look know what at, is. Look at these. Be- there's beautiful art behind it. It's a gorgeous tree. It's it's a big full tree with like blue silver. Is that gold? Bl- yeah, blue oh silver and gold. There's like stars in it. Now we don't get to see the topper, so we don't know if there's a. That's I imagine true. there's a very expensive topper on this. This looks like a professional tree. It even has lights in it. It does. I mean, this tree is intense. It, it is. I. The only question I have is, how many slaves did he buy to assemble this tree? <laughs> I as would hope his none. Like, 
I imagine this in Georgia, big farmhouse. You know who this is? Do you know I who do. this tree it is? Oh, I do. you do? Okay. Yeah. I don't know who's I don't any personally of these know him. Oh, but I don't know who any of these trees are. Yeah. So I'm just like, I'm not sure. But it's, I, a, it's a great it tree. It is a beautiful tree. I'm going to give it an 8.5. No, I'm giving it, see, I like the color coordination with the blue and then the blue in the background. So I'm going to give oh, it a 9. Oh, wow. Ron's giving it a 10. Oh, my God. That's intense. All right, calm down, racist. You know, you know, <laughs> just because it's a white guy doesn't mean it's a 10. Who says a white guy? We don't know. Oh, my God. Look at that tree. Dude. We have no idea who. White guy didn't put it together, but a white guy owns it. Uh, how do you know? <laughs> how do you know that? <laughs> We know. You do, I don't know. Uh, I disagree with you strongly. Should I reveal who this is? Yes, please. It's, it, I don't know. His name's Alan. Our boy, Alan Channing. Thank you, Alan. Yes. The, the, it's a beautiful tree. You I look love, like you have a very beautiful house. I love that you gave me blue balls. And yes. if you live in the tri-state area or not, just please house me for a little bit. Oh, my gosh. I would love it. All right. Next tree. Next tree. All right. This tree. This is like... I like that it's a full form. It's full I, frontal. I also like the fact that it has presence. presence. Yeah. It's the first one. Is that the first one we've seen presence that first wasn't one actually with the a presence. dog? Yeah. And I really like the treetop. So it's like one of those trees that's like kind of like painted. It might be like spray painted white or whatever you want to call it. Like it's, 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 it's a cool tree. The treetopper is a Santa, which is just plus points in my book. Um, I like... And it has presents. First one we've seen with presents. That's true. And I feel like it's a realistic tree. Like I also a, feel like there's pers like the last tree didn't have any like personal ornaments. This one I feel like there's personal ornaments on it. I'm a big fan of personal ornaments. No, the last tree had personal slaves assembling it. This has personal <laughs> ornaments. <laughs> the stars on the last tree did look dangerous. Yeah. They look like throwing star. Like they were gonna poke your eye out. It's the kind of tree you don't touch. Yeah. This looks like a, a tree that was assembled with some love and care. If this was a porn, this would be like a homemade realistic porn. Like, yes. it's not too big. It's not overly thick. Like, it's just a nice size. It's going to get the job done. Yes. You're showing the whole thing. I you know, I'm feeling that. The I'm, tip is nice. I'm going to go with an eight on this one. Ron's giving it a five. Ron, what a five? That's, that's rude. Oh my god! That's rude. Oh, I guess we have to. My do, god, Ron, you're going to rethink revealing. this. You're, you're getting real racist now because this is our boy Daniel. As their boy Daniel, I think that this is there's a nice a, personal this is a touch nice tree. tree. I, I like this tree. Yeah, I like go. to be under it. <laughs> Please give me away his gift. Who's next? Oh, let's, oh let's my go. god! Don't let's... tell us who's next. No, I'm not. Go yeah. All right, next tree. This one. Ah, see, this, this tree looks like. This is a nice tree. I like it's a, a really nice tree. I like the lights. It's it's a full tree. It also has a really nice photo bomb. I mean, who gets their dog to, to pose Those so hard, perfectly? Is that, is that laminate or is that hardwood? That's going to That's That is gonna hardwood decide. floors. Is it though? Or is it laminate? I'm not I sure. I think it's hardwood floors. It's very shiny. Yes. <laughs> the last tree came from the hood. <laughs> Just because you have a hood tree does not make it a bad tree. That makes it a, t a tough tree. Yeah, that means it has at least one heroin needle in it. That's good. <laughs> this so. tree has it also has a nice tree topper. It's got this, this giant star that's really brightly lit. There's a lot of nice ornaments in this. This is a nice tree. This is a, a like a semi-professional tree. Not as professional as the the I'm gonna poke your eye out tree. Yes, no, not slave uh, Lord Allen. <laughs> not um, Lord. Yes, my Lord Allen. <laughs> this is uh, <laughs> this is this is close, but not quite there. What I'm curious about is why is it in a flood zone? This is the only tree that's lifted up. Like, are oh, that you, is true. It does you seem about like to get hit by a hurricane. This is like, a guy waiting. On? Yeah. What's going on? <laughs> Ron, uh, Ron <laughs> says that he judges like Simon Cowell, so he's going hard. Ah, uh, this is the dog really adds. Like I do like. I mean, he's. I'm going to say pupper. that the the thing. What do they call that? The mat around the bottom is a little sus. So it loses a little bit what for do you that. Mean? You have to have a mat around the tree, right? Yeah, but it's not as like it doesn't enhance the tree. And the waiters, like it looks like it's a it's it's got the. What uh, is a waiter? What do they call it? Like ankle, you, you know, when your pants are ankle high? Capri pants. This oh, tree okay. has capri pants on. Yeah, uh, okay. Yeah, it's lifted up. It's in a flood zone. Ron gives it a 7. I'm going to give it a 7.5. I like the dog, though. And I do like the dog. If it, it has some presents, I would up it to an 8, but I can't. 7.5? That pupper, that's a, I don't know. I I'm like the pupper a lot. I'm going to need I to see more pupper, pupper picks. Yeah, yes. If you send us more pupper picks, we might bump your score up. Yes. And our scores are completely arbitrary. So they somebody are. might I've already could, forgotten all of them. Yeah, like we don't know who's going to win. It could just be randomly anything. Yeah, I don't know. It might be whoever's in the chat. I don't know. Yes. Um wait, okay. no, we got to tell who oh. it is. We got oh, oh, Who is yeah, that yeah, tree? Yeah. This, this this was our boy Charlie. Charlie. Charlie, good tree. 
Step up your even uh, better pupper. If you're in a flood zone, maybe we'll excuse it. We are, yes. Uh, so let's go to the next tree. <laughs> Mark D says it's elevated to keep the dog from pissing off. I honestly thought That's about that. That's a good that. call. Yeah, I honestly thought about that. But mm. let's uh, let, let's go on to the next okay, one. Okay, next tree, next tree. Yeah. Okay, this tree is this tree. There's a lot going on here. I do like the picture that was sent with Merry Christmas involved. Like that's, I do that's like nice. the thought put into like this yeah. is a this is a workman tree because it's doing a lot of work here. It's, it's almost acting like a light source. I even see a Santa on the shelf. It's a little weird. Yeah, but like this it's is not an elf on the shelf. It's a Santa. This on is the a shelf. nice blue collar tree, like a one household, you know, one income household family. <laughs> if the wife steps out of line, you hit her immediately. <laughs> put her in the kitchen. It has lights. It does. There's a, at least a Santa ornament. We cannot see the tree topper, so we can't. Yeah, that's I mean, a big part of it, folks. You need to have that tree topper. There are presents. That's a big plus too. When you send pics of your wood, you got to show the best part, and that's the tip. You got to show. That's the tip. what's going in first, boys. <laughs> we got to know what the tip is doing. Yeah. I do like the presents. That's a that's a that's a lot of presents. That is a lot. That is a, a nice haul. Yeah. Somebody's got got a nice haul going on. Clearly, Ron doesn't like hood trees. Wow, Ron! This man Ron is a is white Elias if I've ever seen brutal. one. Brutal. Yeah. Your tree reviews are brutal. Oh my gosh! Can't what? wait to see if you sent us your wood, Ron. Uh, he he may have the upper hand because yeah. he had an unexpected visitor. Oh my god! <laughs> I I don't I, I like the tree. I like the presentation. I like the presence. It's tucked in. It's snug. It'll get the job done. What do you think? It might not get you to orgasm, but it'll get you there. It'll it'll get the job. Uh, seven and a half. This is, this is our boy Ray. Ray, nice yeah. job, Ray. Ray, I thank like you it. for the Merry Christmas. We like it. I I'm still a little sus on that Santa on the shelf. He's kind of looking at me like uh, he's giving me the eye there. I don't know what's going on there. Yeah. And he's looking in the mirror. A little sus. A little sus. Who's looking in the mirror? Look, Santa is looking in the mirror. Oh, okay. See him. He's like eyeballing himself. That's a little bit. That's a little weird. Yeah. All right. I'm a little uncomfortable. We'll go to the next one. We should. All right. Okay. This one is an exotic one. We actually don't know where half these people are from. This this tree looks like it's from a made-up country, to be honest. <laughs> a country that is... The, that's not even Santa Claus. That is Santos Cruz. Probably. Wait, what is that guy? Isn't there... Isn't there something... Didn't he teach us something about... The Netherlands. I they remember I, he said something about is that guy racist? They is definitely there a guy worship Hitler. Ra no, but there's a guy who's like supposed to be racist, who's like Santa's best friend. Ah, uh, and they dress up like him, and they were like, "It's racist." Oh shit, that's I right. don't remember what that was. Not the Prime Minister of Canada doing blackface, though, right? No, it's not Justin Trudeau. This tree looks. It's like um, it's a full tree. It's got like it stacked is. layers of lights. It's a little like got that white tip spray paint thing. I don't think I've seen a real tree yet. All oh, these have been fake trees, people. Well, I don't have a real tree. I, I can't afford that shit. I know that's like for rich for people. Rich why, why doesn't Alan have that? Al, that's got to be a real tree. Oh, maybe we, he has to lose a point for that. Alan's definitely got a real tree. You don't know. Uh, so the only thing that's a little sus about this is that this looks like a zebra stripe uh, blanket here yes so clearly looks a little kinky all men in the Netherlands are homosexual <laughs> oh my god no <laughs> and there's a weird bed down here I'm gonna assume it's for an animal but it could be for a person yes that's I think that it, you're losing points for what's not there and there's a pupper that involved that's in this house I've seen it it's just not in the picture yeah how do you not you get your pupper to point. participate and you know what else is missing English because you're not in America. Mm -mm. Nope. There's no tree topper. Oh my god! I just realized that. That's a little disappointing. That is weird. You need something up there, like an angel or a Santa or a star, something. Uh, yeah, that I, proves your dominance. Probably. Well, they're in you Europe. Tip. Is anything gotta dominant tip. in Europe? Got to tip the tip, top the tip. Nothing in Europe is dominant. Tip top. Yes. Good. And the sus blanket. I don't know. That's Ron weird. gives it an eight. I might give it an eight too. Uh, I'm gonna go seven. It is world. Wow. There's worldly. no pupper. Oh, there's you, no you pupper. Lose one whole point. If so you show negative. the bed of a pupper and don't have the pupper, that it, might be a negative. Daniel's point. got a good point. Negative point for skinning a zebra. I understand that completely. <laughs> negative one point for skinning a zebra. That's fair. I heard Netherland people are poachers. So if you if you if you weren't sure who this was, 
It's it, Infinity. It is our old friend, Infinity NL. NL. That's he. I don't know what weird time it is in that fake country right now, but he's clearly not he's on. He's probably on YouTube streaming, not in English. Yes. Borgen Tigen Trogen. Schnugen Dagen. Yes. Schlingen Lagen. We love all of our Europe listeners. Yes. <laughs> you don't see the al- the homeless alcoholic Santa Claus. I mean, he. I can't tell what's going on with that Santa. I I don't know either. And there's also this weird sus little statue here. I don't know. There's other things going on. So it's all weird. Let's go to the next one. All right. This tree. If you had to guess whose tree this is, because it's so enormous. This is this tree looks like it's thirty feet tall. It is. He's overcompensating for sure. <laughs> It's entirely possible. Clearly, that man doesn't keep his phone charged either. <laughs> does he not keep his phone he does charged? Not. Look at that. Look at that. Look at this tree, though. It's definitely like 30 feet tall. Is there even a topper on it? No. Oh, no. There's, there's no not. topper. You heard that big of a tree and you don't even put the tip in? Well, how are you supposed to get up that high when the get tree's 30 ladder. feet tall? He, had, he has like a cutout in his roof, get which is rich man stuff. Ladder. That means you got a rich man house. No. Yes, it does. When you have a cutout in your roof. He clearly murdered somebody. Oh, and just took over the house. Yes. It does have nice ornaments, and I like the way that the lights glitter. It's a nice tree. I, I'm, I mean, it's a big tree. It's enormous. I, sure. I like the lights, and the, it looks nice. It's a nice, solid tree. Absolutely. I don't know. I need to see what Ron's judgment on this tree is before I make my decision. No, oh, no. Ron, Ron needs to come down Ron's hard gonna on give this. It a, I think he's going to give it an eight. I give this a two. What? Overcompensating. Oh, my God. The man's got the tiniest penis, probably. <laughs> He's so <laughs> you oh, I think you already know who's this is. Then. Oh, I do. You're antagonizing. He someone, needs to go to you? a doc. Oh my gosh! It is the one, the only, the doctor of all docs. Doctor Puss Puss. Our best friend and yours, the greatest doc we know. The worst GTA doc. player in existence. He is, he's and, gonna whoop you so and bad. Ghost of Tsushima. He's gonna annihilate you. You're too scared to even play Ghost of Tsushima. I'm going to cancel my Christmas with my family and play it right now. You will not because you're too scared. I will absolutely uh, not do that. Yes, I know because you're, right. you're a big pansy. Good. Is pansy um, allowed? To, are we allowed? To, this was pa- Doc's tree. I, mean, I think we're allowed. So thank you, Doc, for sharing your tree. Yeah. I don't even know that he entered the contest. He was just like, look at my enormous wood. Yeah, he's not winning. Oh, Ron gives it an eight. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. All the things are rigged against Doc. Yeah. So Doc is is out of the running. 6.3. I think I align more with that. <laughs> 6.3 on yeah. the Richter scale. Definitely not inches, though. <laughs> Pounds. He's clearly a three or two. Oh my gosh. Let's move on. Ooh, I like this. So, all right. First of all, I'm uncomfortable with the amount of teddy bears. <laughs> this is a class. See, to me, this is classic, though. Like, no, this, this is, is rapey. No, but, yeah, but th- there's a This a has bonus a Ted point. Bundy vibe written all over Look at it. this, though. Oh there's my gosh. Is that, is that a nice pussy? And guess who it is? Oh, you might not know. It's it's a, it's a little bit of Tink Tink. It's a Tink. It, what? That's uh, that's. I think that's his cat's name. Tink Tink. I think it's Tink. You might. And really... look at that. Tr- that is the the most dominant and powerful of all tree toppers we have seen so far. That is I'll absolutely. Give you that, but what is going on? It's Nancy. Your oh, the cat is your, Nancy. Your cat's name Nancy. is oh. fucking Nancy. <laughs> it's Negative a Nancy five boy. points. Why? What's Negative. wrong with Nancy? Sergeant Cuddlepuss is a better name. Oh my god! You can't name your cat Sergeant Mr. Cuddlepuss. Mr. Mittens. Those are so sissy names. <laughs> Pansy names. Oh my god! Uh, Ron gives this gives this tree a seven. Captain Cuddlebum. There are a lot of teddy bears. Are they gifts or are they just teddy bears? I also like. The, remember what I said about the personal ornaments. I like personalized ornaments. I like to see that kind of stuff. And the most powerful tree top. I, I, love, I love personal ornaments that have your social security number that we can see <laughs> and, and then steal cards. your identity. Uh-huh. That's really what I'm looking That's for. That's what we're looking for. Da- see, da- Daniel's on point here. Negative nine points for nine teddy bears. There's <laughs> definitely more than fucking nine, though. He's scared. Is he? Is he scared of the teddy bear? See, this man clearly owns a rape <laughs> band, and then four, this is to five, lure six, underage seven, eight, children eight. to him. There might be more than nine. Teddy- Ron, Jennifer. do you work for Wayfair? Is that the <laughs> is that is, your employment agency? <laughs> this is not a Wayfair <laughs> tree. Wayfair teddy bears. <laughs> <laughs> they got the cuddles you need, Ron. <laughs> is that is that what's happening? This is uncomfortable for, for me. For so cool killer, that's. A I think an teddy amber bears. alert is just gonna go up by looking at this. <laughs> you just triggered your own amber alert. Dear oh Lord, my God. you're in trouble because the they're coming for Sweet you. Sweet Christ, you're disqualified. That's, you're judging people's trees, and then you got fucking seven kids in your basement? Shame on you. It's Christmas. 
Oh my god, can we move on? <laughs> if we didn't know, this is Ron. Stone Cold Killer. Did, Stone Cold Killer. Yeah. <laughs> he, he's earned his name today. Oh my god. <laughs> America's most wanted. Ah, oh, here we go. This is a truly classy tree. Ah, frail and white. Yep. <laughs> That's uh... <laughs> Why? 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 With a Santa hat on top. What the fuck? It's, not a, it's, a, it's a snowman. There's a it's lot. Kinda... Snow. Oh, that's right. Snowman with a Scrooge hat. No, you never watched Frosty the Snowman? Nope. You don't know who Frosty the Snowman is? I do not. Wow. Are you, have you really been that Frosty the Ho child? Man I've watched many times. Frosty the Snowman. This is a. This is an all white tree. <laughs> yeah, looks like a snowman. No, it looks... has lights in it. <laughs> looks like you're only for the whites. <laughs> It is not a, it is, this is a classy tree. Looks like all other colors were excluded from this tree. It, the, the snow, it has a giant snowman head as a tree topper with a snowman hat. Sure. And it's got a nice uh, sweater on there. Uh, the best topper so far. Absolutely. Look at not. this. This is win, 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 baby. Daniel, you were, you were in the front running for this win, but now after that comment, not so much. <laughs> we'll see what you think about the next tree, though. You couldn't come back. Mark D says that's the tree he got for a straight from Family Dollar. I don't know. That seems like a legit tree. Uh, this is a win. Oh my gosh! Did Ron just give it a three? And this Ron. looks like you bought this from Goodwill. So whose tree is this? This? Oh my! Is that your tree? This is Z's tree. It is, it's the Z tree. <laughs> it is the Z tree. It is a snowman. This yeah. is a tree that is takes place in. My homestead. Uh, unfortunately, in the corner, like it deserves to be. <laughs> What's wrong with it being in the corner? Because uh, no one Nobody puts it. the snowman in the corner. Everybody puts Frost in the corner. Yeah, you see, you know who Frosty is. Uh, just yeah, Frosty the Home Man. It's uh, on Pornhub. Gotcha. Frosty the I Home Man. I favorited it. Right. When my premium right. subscription subscribed, expired. Now we have the most diminutive and saddest tree I think I've ever. This is probably this isn't even a tree. It looks like a feather duster. This it's looks, about two feet tall. It's all about the subtlety. It is for me. It's just honestly, the, this is a man that is obviously full it of, is, of vibrance. It is red and it is white. This is the saddest Christmas tree. I've maybe seen one or two Christmas trees it more pathetic than this one. Christmas trees. It's for not me. even. There's no lights. There's it, no bulbs. There's no bobbles. It is the light. There's not. It looks like an afterthought in the corner. It looks like what's that thing from Doctor Seuss? It's the candy cane that everyone wants in their mouth. Oh my God! This is a, a, <laughs> the trees in time out. If I could give this, this a score a higher than tree. a ten, I would give it a twenty. That's just me, I though. I think it's probably closer to a negative five. Wow, Mark is saying this is a toilet paper holder. <laughs> Uncomfortable. I agree, yes. This does look like a toilet. Is that not toilet paper? No, this looks like a plunger that I would just shove into your bum hole. <laughs> well, this one is a negative zero. Negative and, zero. And damn. So much. If, you had to, if you had to guess whose tree this was. It's a noob noob tree. Uh, <laughs> of course, the most pathetic tree is owned by noob noob. This is the saddest. This is a great this is really, tree. Really, this is the only tree you have in your house, correct? Uh, I have another one that's uh, uh, green, but it's the same thing. <laughs> it looks like a toilet bowl, a toilet yeah. tree holder. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, why don't you have a real tree? Cause my house, I don't know. I'm homeless. This you're is, not homeless. You do have really weird uh, curtains. It's yeah, they're blackout of, uh, curtains. Looks like someone skinned the cat in the hat. There oh you go. Oh my god. <laughs> That's exciting. <exactly> Daniel, <laughs> you know I have the code, right? I can purposely not give it to you. <laughs> oh, this is a pretty sad tree. So, Where's your Christmas spirit? Welcome to the noob noob tree. Dear and Lord. we do have another tree. We have one more to wrap this up. Wait, off. what? Yeah, we have one more tree. We do. Oh, we do. Yes, yeah, we yes, had a, yes, yes, uh, yes. a late tree come in. We did. This tr this is pretty classy. I don't know. Although it does say it has names on it, so we'll have to dead name some people. Let me shrink it down <laughs> it has a little names? bit. Uh, yeah, look. Uh, to Jason from Kebab. Oh, my God. It's from a meat? <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> so I, I'm a little confused as to why there are shoes there. Why? They look like very warm shoes and very why comfortable. Why do you have... This looks like the first real tree. It does kind of look like, oh shit, it is a real tree. Yeah, and these ornaments are, and look at this, like all Elegant. of the wrapping paper is coordinated. Elegant. 
It is an elegant tree, yes. Clearly, it has lights and nice little uh, ornaments, like baubles. It's very nice. Clearly a house full of midgets, according to those shoe sizes. <laughs> but shoe size is like a, like a two. That's, um, they got some stumpy feet. But, uh, <laughs> their shoes do look a little weird. They look like hiking boots. This could be from, like, Alaska. This uh, could be from Alaska. Look at the brick in the background. I mean, who has a brick house? Uh, it could just be a fireplace. This is, well, either way, it's classy. It is. It's classy in my book. Seems like it's in a cold climate. I'm just guessing. I'm just, well, if you need shoes lined with fleece, yeah. I'm going to guess it's cold. And this does look like someone gave someone meat. So this, wrapped in a, One of the presents looks like it's been wrapped in butcher paper and looks like a log of meat. Oh, my God. Oh, Ron calls it. He says it's the winner. It's a it's real, a real tree. tree. Yeah, your tree is definitely not the winner. <laughs> you rapist. <laughs> What's he going to say? His, his tree's the for the winning tree? Rapist. <laughs> oh, geez. So I think that is, uh, that is, that's all of them, I think. Oh, he pressed the golden button. Ron was impressed by this final tree. Whose tree is this tree? This is Jeff. Jeff. Our boy Jeff. Well, looks like Jeff. Uh, we're, we're going with the chat. We're going with the real winner here, Jeff. This is a classy tree, Jeff. Don't disappoint us, and don't disappoint Bond. Wait, did we just make Jeff the winner? Yeah, he pressed the golden button. Oh. Yeah, Ron pressed the golden button. Real tree. This is the first real tree we've seen. Your tree ain't winning. Your tree looks like a toilet bowl plunger. Oh, my God. Here's the worst tree. Clearly the worst tree. And that's not even a joke. It's real. That's really his tree. Oh, my goodness. It is terrible. So well, be sure to cat. If you're a, I know we have many audio listeners. This is one of those episodes you should probably tune into on YouTube. So give it a check. Probably give it, a, give it a check out. You need to. You need to have that visual wood in your life. You Got to get that wood. Well, but, fake wood and. So uh, wood. you're you're choosing the winner for me. I guess that's fine. I, I guess said Je the check I guess to do Jeff it. wins. I think Jeff wins. Is, uh, it, is everybody else? Oh, oh my God! Jeff is winner, here. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Jeff wins. He was silently here the whole time. She looks like it's, it says. Can F you Christmas. confirm that you have tiny people in your house? Like, do you have tiny? Feet? Do you have like slave midgets? Is what, what? I'm thinking. No, it's just um, tiny pygmy people. people you've kidnapped from the wilderness. Pygmy people. Do you live in a British Columbia, in a wooded area? Maybe where Wolverine was in that Origin movie that sucked. Oh yeah, Wolverine Origins. Do you uh, live near where Origin Wolverine Origins is? We maybe. at least need to know like. What part of the world slash country? Because, you know, mostly USA, great. Yep. But So the the clear not winner is Ron, because he's a dick. Why? Um, he, pick, he, he gave he, my tree a bad score. You score, your tree sucked. My tree's the best. Your tree was the worst the tree. The best. It's the best. Workshop of elf slaves. There we go. That's <laughs> okay. all right. You can be the winner now. I like that you have elf slaves. He's a big, big, big time purporter of what slavery. What I'm going to do, though. Who, gonna move to Liberia. What contestants are still in the live chat? Let me know. Who's in the live chat still as the contestants? Uh, there's still people out there. Dan, I'm gonna, I need an active. I need oh, an Mark active D response. never sent his tree, so we don't know what his tree looks like. Yeah, so Jeff is the winner of James Bond. You win the Bond. But if oh, there are still secret, participants super in the live chat, you might have a little extra surprise coming Ooh, in the new year. First, I'm going to need you to tell me who's still there, though. First you might, to respond. If you dropped off after you uh, didn't win, then shame on you. Shame, shame, shame on you. Shame on you. We have a lot new, of news new, to go through and always, a lot of reviews. We do. Not a lot of reviews, but we're going to go. Some, we're a speed round, though. Yes. <laughs> Jeff was here earlier, and he, he's like, I want to win the second prize. Ooh, what's that? You're not getting the second prize, Jeff. Don't be greedy. Don't be greedy. This is a Christmas spirit. We have to. You get like, to watch it, Ed Armas for five whole minutes looking sexy. Oh my gosh! He does. Rec he also recommends that. I guess we got to drink it on air now. I actually, we could review that drink if you write down who was whose recipe was. Monster Meister. Oh, Daniel's in here. Oh, uh, right. Daniel. Daniel's there. So what's the win? What's All right, the Daniel gets to choose from one of the two movies that I'm buying in January, which is wow. Halloween Kills and something else that I forget. <laughs> Shit. So either take, either take the round robin. I'll, I'm gonna go look. Oh my gosh. Hold on. Uh, whose recipe w were we? Oh, and Ray. All right, all right. Well, I'll, okay. So Daniel gets to choose first since he was uh, he, he was quick to the draw. And then uh, Jeff, if you want the second one, you can get it. Hold on. Let's see. What did I get? I got Halloween Kills for sure. And uh, oh, Dune. Oh, Dune. Whoa. Dune and Halloween Kills are up for grabs, Daniel. And it, I have been asked to do a full Dune breakdown review, which I may do. I, I got to think about it. I might have to get some new equipment to make that happen. Oh my god! Oh so my let's uh, let's move on while they sort these uh, these winners out here. Yeah, and, you guys uh, fight amongst each other in the chat. 